here we are with Call of the Night episode 10. So yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think, and I would say let's get to the episode. Mates. <laughs> So this is the one girl from the vampires. Her eyes are crazy with the white pupils. Here we go again. She doesn't want to hang out with other vampires because then it's about popularity again. Oh my god, the sound of her eyes. <laughs> this is interesting again, again, right? No one she can hang out with, really, because stuff came up for the guys. I guess she wants to turn into vampires eventually. And otherwise, just vampires are free. And she doesn't want to hang out with vampires because then it's all about popularity again, right? Because that's what vampires do in this world, right? Talking about popularity and everything is all about popularity. Who can make the most offspring, I guess, and who's the popular, the most popular one because of the offspring thing. And yeah, now the outsider Nazuna, that no one likes because she is not girl-like. She's not about the stuff that other vampires are all about. Now she suddenly is wanted by everyone because everyone starts to feel the same way, kind of like, where they don't want to talk non-stop about that stuff, right? So it's very interesting to see this. <clears throat> How many are left? We have <clears throat> three more. We have the one with the red hair. I think her name was Nick. I don't know. Something Nick. Something like that. And then the one with the long hair. The black long hair. And the one with the short black hair. The MILF. <laughs> I wonder if we see like the last three episodes of those. Oh my god, made Nazuna. <laughs> Hell yeah. I saw a meme about this. Do we see this in this episode? <laughs> Bamp mates. Of course. <laughs> Oh my god. Then don't blow your cover. <laughs> Extra cute. <laughs> the 
the cute one. Mm. Yeah, cute. Wow. <laughs> He's rating it. <laughs> oh, who's this? First time home, <laughs> right? I'm your mate. Damn, oh my god, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Each day I watch anime, there's food. <laughs> no, so no. <laughs> Damn, that's good. <laughs> Of course. Oh, really? And then she took it away. <laughs> Pretty much. I guess for him it's all the same, right? God damn. <laughs> Unimpressed. Hard day of work, probably just like now or so. Oh, is another now starting to work here? Who took the photos? That's what I thought. This is a meme. <laughs> oh, this is social media. Okay, yeah. Oh. The stalker? Man, the the maid outfit in this anime looks so good. I mean, you saw her head, one picture. Help me. I want to punish him that he doesn't take his photo of me because I'm the number one. It looks so good, the maid outfit, man. God. Oh my god, hello. The style of this anime is just so good. Everything looks so good in this anime. anime. Hello. Oh my god, and here she is. <laughs> I 
right? I mean, it's not her fault. God damn. Detective Co. Oh. Don't mind me, I'm just looking outside the window here. <laughs> Dude, he's faster than Sonic. Again. And it's locked. <laughs> Going from the outside. But would a culprit could climb up there? Oh, God damn it. Assassin's Creed Nazuna. <laughs> Man, I like Nazna the way she talks. Yeah, uh, the girl is missing. <laughs> oh, did she maybe took the photos herself? To get more popular? Because it's on the social media page, right? And she was the number one before. <clears throat> Detective Co. <laughs> that line, dude. Mm -hmm. 80, 60, 40, 50. <laughs> She's coming. Oh my god, they're in the same locker. 
It's getting hot in here. <laughs> oh, I love the particles of the light shining through. With the dust. God damn, dude. God damn. Respectfully. <laughs> It was a lie. Uh oh. <laughs> she wants the number one spot again. I guess so. And then it can look shaky and everything. Underwear? Naked? That stuff? Okay. They were just like some teasing photos, <laughs> is what he means. You saw a bit, but never ever everything. <laughs> Popularity. Of course not, that's what he's saying. I mean, isn't that what vampires are doing the whole time? Wanting to be the best, the most popular one, basically? That's all what they are about? I guess so, and I guess because it's good, decent money, right, for not doing much. I mean, I shouldn't say you're not doing much, it's basically customer service and that, pain, that, that kind of job is a pain in the ass.
I'm just meaning that if you are working in a maid cafe, you basically have to look good and have to be good at customer service, right? And that's it. You don't need any other specific skills. That's what I mean. But it's still a pain in the ass to work in customer service. Damn, that looks cute. Oh boy. How does the face look? Not bad. Hey, another one and Midori in the background. <laughs> I love it. Is the after credit scene? Probably not. No. Okay, that was the episode. Let me know what you think. But yeah, um, I got the beginning wrong. I thought the text message she got was one of her dates that cancelled her basically and said, nah, I can't make it. Um, And then... That it was basically, she had no one else to hang around with, right? After work, basically. But yeah, actually, it was that one of the maids said she couldn't make it to work. And that was the problem. And so that's why Nazana came in handy. Because she needed someone that couldn't take a top spot from her. So Nazana, that is not good with other people, was the perfect choice for her. Um, but yeah, I loved that episode. Funny episode. Really good episode. I loved the detective throw in i think it was really funny um also some good lines like <laughs> coast iq only goes up when peeping tom uh, pictures are involved <laughs> uh and yeah it, it, it was fun right and uh it's very interesting i would say i mean there wasn't much right it was basically this whole detective thing going on which i think was really good i liked it and then <clears throat> reminded me a bit of um, Detective Conan, right? And then the end, basically, which is like really interesting again that she, that Midori said, taking these Peeping Tom photos, these fake ones, and to get like more popular, basically, it's an illness, she said. And I mean, yes, right? Somewhat, in a way. And I mean, later she also basically acknowledges that she is also, that she also has like an illness because for all this popularity, right? And I mean, yeah, illnesses can come in all, can come in all sizes and shapes and all that stuff, right? It can be that you are like very envious about like pretty much everything is someone is like popular and all that stuff. It, it can come in all ways. There's so much stuff that is like, that can be an illness psychologically and it's interesting that they have like this aspect to it and that they talk about it that like basically all humans have an illness in some way right because i guess even something like being a perfectionist can be an illness um being a workaholic is pretty much an illness that it's so many things can be seen as an illness if you don't if you do it too much and it consumes you basically and in some way that's something that everyone has in one way or another for certain aspects so yeah i mean like i said there wasn't much else right it's a very chill episode good episode like the detect detective twist and i mean nazana in maid clothes looks amazing overall like the maid outfit in this anime with the character design is just top notch and the whole art style of this anime i just love it and um 
I think I had something in mind that I wanted to talk about. Oh yeah, <clears throat> the the line where she is like, "Don't zoom in," um, when he checked the peeping tom photos the first time. I saw a meme of that where you have like from the manga where you basically there are three frames at the top of the page where it zooms in on the cleavage of an anime girl <laughs> and then you see underneath it Ko zooming in on the phone and then underneath that it's Midori saying hey don't zoom in <laughs> it's I feel like that's a great meme template for like stuff where it's basically you zoom in on something and then it's like Ko zooming in and then don't zoom in you can use it for like all kinds of stuff it doesn't necessarily have to be like something lewd it can be like all sorts of things where you can like zoom in on something and the response is hey don't zoom in uh so but i mean what i didn't know was if this w would i i had a guess that this is the episode where that comes where we see that right because we saw at the beginning of the episode and mate um but i mean now that nazana works there i wasn't sure if that's like oh my by the end when she when they said that Nazana works already, I mean, by that time we already saw it. But I mean, we didn't know if we might see this more often, right? Or if this is like a single time. Because now, I mean, Nazana works here. Which I guess makes good sense, right? I mean, before she made money by doing the massage thing. And now that she hangs out with Ko the whole time, she and sucks his blood, she doesn't really do this massage geek anim uh, anymore, right? So doing this maid job and having good pay from what they said is a good idea right and so yeah i guess this could also maybe get nazana more in the direction of like a relationship right because in this job she has to be somewhat nice and cute right i mean but maybe her character is just that she is not that typical maid right like Midor midori said nowadays you might have need like a character that stands out that is different right so i mean maybe but i mean it maybe can help that towards the relationship between ko and nazana right maybe maybe not we will see but yeah i love this episode and it was very interesting a good episode again so yeah can't wait for the next episode i guess maybe the next three episodes will be maybe the other three vampires that are missing like each of them gets like an episode where we see them like what they do for a living basically outside of meeting up with the other vampires and that stuff the private jobs basically the private lives because last episode we saw uh, sherry that she hangs out with guys and all that stuff a bit we saw that stuff and now we saw midori with the mate gig and so there are three missing i guess maybe we see them like i said will be interesting can't wait and so yeah if you like what you saw leave a like subscribe or comment let me know what you think and i would say thanks for watching until next time Bye bye